Hello, hello, how are we doing guys? Howdy, howdy, howdy hoodle, howdy doodle. Howdy, howdy, howdy hoodle, how you doodle. Right. We have a small problem here. Let me just... We have a small problem here. There's only one virtual machine. Because... When I had to swap to... When Ubuntu decided to stop booting, I lost... All of my virtual machines. Which means the partially complete Linux from scratch one. However... And I do mean, however, because as we found out last time, it only takes an hour and a half to go from start to nearly completed. We should be able to get to the desktop today. I do mean should be able to. So that is what we're going to do. First things first, I need to make sure that the disk is in, there's media in the disk. That will be the plan for today to hopefully, and I do mean hopefully. Ah. You're being dumb. You're being dumb. Uh, boot options, this one, enable boot menu. Apply. Then that. Here, bada bing. Here we go. So, this will be the goal today. Hi, Ben. How you doing, my friend? Hello, Pancake Sparkle and Party Sepe. I hope all of you are having a wonderful day. I... Well, yeah, I lost all my operating system. Ubuntu just went... Eh. And stopped. Couldn't even get it to boot. It just went into recovering a journal. And then... Never again. So, I don't, I don't know. Shut up. Try Ubuntu. Something funny that I did found, find out. Because my computer has a speaker in the case. And it's, it's now connected to the motherboard. Anytime I'm doing something in uh, uh, Linux and I hit the backspace, backspace and there's nothing to do but my uh, motherboard just goes, nope. Sp speaker in the case just goes, nope. It just beeps every time I go to do something and it doesn't like it. It just goes, nope. Just beeps. Beeps out at me every time. I love that. Uh, first things first, we need settings. Power, never go to sleep. Display, set that to 1920 by 1080. Thank you very much. It's going to be a hard time considering the meds I'm on. Right, software and updates. So, first things first. Software and updates. You come here, bada bing, bada bing. Close, reload. System monitor resources as we can see here, 30 calls are assigned. Okay, so we need to come into here and we will, we, we will be using release candidate for Linux from scratch, Linux from scratch.org, unless version 12 has come out, which I don't know if it has. Read online, current stable version of LFS. What is it? It is out. Oh, I stand corrected, version 12 is out. Right. Stable LFS system D. It was published. Yes. Yesterday. How about it? How about that? That's perfect. Right. So we're going to drop that there. We need a terminal. Open in terminal. CD. Zulo DPKG hyphen reconfigure. Reconfigure dash. Use dash of default, nope. I run the same again, so new form figure dash. Still nope. Right, departed, come here. What we want to do is device partition table MS DOS, yes. Okay. Go on. Right, so free space proceeding. We want one that is 512 megabytes in size. So 512 ext2, and this will be boot. New partition, space following 4096. This will be root fs. And this one will be swap. So we just call it swap. Linux swap, bada bing, done. Click yes, apply. 
Come to the boot partition, manage flags, give it the boot. Done. So far, so good. Now, introduction. Host system requirements. I realise that this looks looks as sound suit, but this is on a 32 inch television. This might actually be a bit bigger than that, but yes, it's on a large television for me, so so that's why there's so much light for it. Hello, Peter. How you doing, my How you doing, my friend? Bada bing, bada boom. G plus plus does not work. G plus plus command not found. That's fine. So what we want to do is I need to grab ASAP software. Then I need to grab a set of software. Indeed we are. Yes. Indeed we are back in hell, my friend. Indeed we are. <sighs> it shouldn't take as long considering it took an hour and a half to get from start to halfway through chapter eight. And chapter eight is the longest chapter of them all, so it's possible we could be at desktop by by this by stream's end. Okay, everything's good. So Unix 98 support, supports Unix 98 PTY. Good, so everything we need is done. This just explains this. We don't need to pay attention to that. This again, something we don't need to pay attention to. So, we're at fastest type of VXT4 to create one, but we've already done that. Using existing swap partitions, only format it. If you put new swap, we don't need to do that. X, right, so everyone's favorite thing is so clear. Export. That's eh, not so bad. Export LFS equals MNT LFS. Echo LFS to make sure it works, which it did, of course it did. Mounting the new partition. So, make directory hyphen PV LFS. Mount hyphen, as we want to do LSB, okay, list of blocks. So, we want to do mount hyphen verbose hyphen t xt4 slash dev slash base slash dev slash vda2 what ah that's why <laughs> Oh, I was about to start crying, and then again, I realized I'm stupid. I'm a stupid. Slash sbin, slash swap on hyphen v, slash dev, slash vda3. Okay, so what we want to do... Mount hyphen V hyphen T EXT two slash dev slash VDA one LFS Oh it does not exist right hang on. So make directory hyphen V Oot. Done. We have all of these made and done. We're good. Hopefully, no more issues. We have boot, regular, and sorted. So, we want to do make directory LFS sources and make it sticky with chmod hyphen v or verbose a plus wt. Of their sources, which makes it one one treble seven or rewrite, read write, execute, read write, execute, read write, sticky, whatever the hell that I can't remember. So, w get that, grab that, and then run this command. I'll then hopefully download everything, hopefully without throttling. I will crack get throttled. And we'll then go through. So how how uh, how are we all doing today, guys? 
Uh, I had an interesting time this morning. I woke up a couple times during my sleep, and I think according to the side effects of my medication, my new medication that is, um, increased body temperature, yeah that is correct. Nausea, that's also correct. No rash. I haven't had coughing or wheezing shortness. I have had dilated pupils. And one of the weird things that I had, which I do admit was a bit weird, is I think I had... I think I was having some ocular pressure issues. Because... Like my eyes were weren't focusing and like things were like getting bigger and smaller and bigger and smaller. I was looking at my hands, they looked increased in size. And my phone looked tiny in my hands. Like I, I don't I don't know. I think I was having ocular pressure issues. But uh, I'll tell the doctor when I speak to him for three weeks' time. Good. Yeah, it's good you put gun up at your invader. It's very good. Oh that's why I got that money that's in my pocket back in my wallet. Oh god. Oh. It's not fucking crying. That's right, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Yet. Right, whilst we're waiting for that, to have, whilst we wait, we hydrate. Have some coffee whilst we wait, shall we? Hmm. Have my eyes. Um, finish clock. Okay, so well, let's hope that works. What we want to do now is get the MD5 sum, so copy the link. We get MD5. Oh yeah, we need to do CD alpha sources double you get copy link MD5 sources. Right. Now we run these. Okay, good. Nothing there, that's fantastic. Right, that explains all the packages, we don't need that, that explains that, we don't need things for that. <sighs> it's introduction, this is just the general stuff that we need to do. Next to tool directory, because we're going to need that for the uh, temp uh, for the cross compile tools. We're going to need later on. This will make the user. I this fan needs to be more fan. This fan needs to be more fan. I swear to God. Please be more fan. Oh my God! You're on the oh my God. I need a fan here, I need a fan here. I'm, I'm dying in the heat. Also, you know, the, the new meds aren't helping. Oh well. If I die, I'm gonna, if I die, at least let it be known I died at my desk. Ooh, That's done something different this time round. Set up the environment. Right, so we need to do exit. Into LFS, bada bing, good. Also this bash profile. Just to be absolutely 100% sure. Post the profile. Good. We can build that one. These are test suites. We can build all that. Introduction in util. So, CD LFS sources. R hyphen XVF bin utils. Because I thought, in my ultimate wisdom, that if I got something directly from the site, 
it would work as intended. But I forget, it's NVIDIA. So why the fuck would that happen? Why would NVIDIA actually have a useful and effective product on their own website? Because I wanted to have faith that it was going to work as advertised and as intended. Evidently, it didn't. I wanted to have faith, you know? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I, 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 that, that is the first thing I did. The, the first... Ow. The first thing I did after installing was to enable the um, various rep repos. So, time, make, minus, B 30 Mm-hmm. Let's look at how fast that's moving. Whilst we wait, we hydrate. Right. I did kind of a silly and took, and took today's med with coffee. <laughs> I mean, it's the quickest way to get my medication working. Just take it with caffeine. It's fine. Don't worry, I'm not going to die. I'm only going to slightly elevate my heart rate. So I make install. So leave the directory. Remove the directory. Tar next tar. I can't tell if I typed that out right, so I'm not going to do it anymore. Okay, the CDGCC. MPFR, GMP, MPC. Done. This is 64 bit hosts. Build. Yes, yeah, it's going to be one of those scenarios where the Complete. Oh, never mind. Time make minus J30. Yeah, you think I've got to upgrade my CPU and my graphics card? Yeah, I'm gonna run that thing into the fucking ground. But also, yes, when upgrading dependencies. Yep. I know, I know. But yeah, the um, NVIDIA software catches it. As we can see here, it's running at 33 degrees Celsius. Nice. I mean, it's working as intended, so... DisplayPort 3, what? What? Either way, it's functioning. It works. Hello, Alex Smith, how you doing? Welcome along. We are currently compiling Linux from scratch today. Dying in the heat from the computer. And also, meds. Yes. Uh, I don't know if I did install NVIDIA SMR. Evidently not. Oh, also, I realised every time I do that, you can see that because that's display capture. Ah, eh, it'll be fine. Ah, I still need to reinstall... Oh, I have to reinstall Dabex. Fair enough. God, the heat's absolutely bloody murder today. Oh, God. Oh, God, that hates murder. Mm, just need to wait for my eyes to focus again. There we go, right. How many bloody SBUs is this? 3.5, we shouldn't be taking this long. Mm, oh, well. But yeah. 
Whilst we wait, we hydrate, guys. Don't forget to drink. Peter, that means you. I'm talking to you, Peter. You need to drink, my guy. Yeah, I've just seen that, Peter. Looks alright. <laughs> say, say the stupid, Peter. Ah, someone's also a doit, uh, from the Flatland. Oh, God, my neck. He's in a meant of bloody murder me. <laughs> oh, I wouldn't say dying. I mean, I've got past a thousand subscribers and I'm still going up. So I wouldn't call that dying. I'd say a bit of a dip. It's all right. No, I'm also trying to get, I'm also getting bots at the minute as well, Peter. Here's the thing, people enjoy watching, and people as far away as uh, Microsoft and students at the University of New South Wales in Australia watch my videos, so frankly, I'm happy. Um, so rm hyphen uh, F G C C R hyphen X V F Linux. So this is going to be the Mac Mr. Proper. And then we're just going to do that. Mental Outlaw is pretty good. I, yo, you know the video, um, the meme video he made where uh, I think her name's Yuki installs Gen 2 on the school's school computers. I actually went and watched that anime because of that video. Pretty good anime. I, I will admit. The Linux. Make Mr. Proper. What's funny is this version of Linux from scratch came out yesterday. So it's actually hang on time. Because I was, I was using the release candidate last time around. Up until the point where I had to start operating it, switch or switch or leave a leave Ubuntu because it decided to never boot again. Because that's my luck. I, I break shit. I'm hyphen RF. I'll hyphen XVF. Jeeps. Uh, as Peter, as Peter here kindly knows, I break anything that I touch. Tech wise, don't I, Peter? Anything that I touch, I break, don't I, mate? This is why, if you want something tested, give it to me. I will find a way to break it. Even then, I've broken arch builds. Because I'm kind of dumb. Right, what did I just do? Um, I just configured... Yeah, just did the configuration. Uh, can fail one... Nah. Time, screw it. Time, make, minus J30. I mean, you use Alma Linux because of work. BS, why go with Ubuntu when you can just use the raw? When you can just use the thing it's derived from? <laughs> CTOS. That's good. That's funny. I like that. That's a funny reference. Especially considering the direction fucking Red Hat's taken it, yeah. 
pretty much. Considering what Red Hat's doing to it. Yep, it's, yeah, it's going that way. It is going that way. See, that makes sense. Again, that also makes sense. I mean, in theory, uh, if you get a Raspberry Pi 4 sticking in a battery, you've got, and uh, if you know how to use the tools that come with Kali Linux, I mean, in theory, it's possible. Sticking in the back, walk by, just do some wall striping. Just to start off with wall striping and go from there. That's not a good enough reason. That's really not a good enough reason. x86 or lib, lib64 ld linux x86 so 2 good that worked so leave the direct you get to hear my famous saying over and over and over again so leave the directory remove the directory tar the next directory oh we don't need to tar the next uh, tar the next directory tar FTCC. Enter the next directory. Nope, but it does give you information on how to scrape things. And if you know what to scrape for, you know, if you know what to look for, that's when you start to become dangerous. That's, that's when you start to become dangerous. Or just fuck with people. Such as if you find a, if you find a network connected printer that's not properly protected, you can just send stuff to it. It's like, oh, by the way, here you go. Uh, I remember seeing a picture of, um, a printer in an office and I just had a printout on it saying this particular port used by this printer is unprotected get your network guys to change it someone just sent it to them and saying hey look you done messed up by the way he's had to fix it and just stopped like shit like that like um uh, lawful crazy lawful good yes Lawful, lawful, uh, lawful crazy. Right, so... Chaotic good, that's what I meant to say. Chaotic neutral, yeah, chaotic good. So, time... I make minus shade 30. I mean, it also depends if the print is unprotected as well. Hello, uh, Grammar Jane. How are you doing? Welcome along. I am Alphys. So leave the directory, remove the directory. There's no next directory to tar. We're now moving on to the cross compiling of the tool chain. M4 next. Oh, hang on. Read this properly. Utilities next chapter after an current environment. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. What's that's called? Second, we were building as root. You may run the usable. This chapter must be done as LFS. Good, right? Okay. Okay. So tar hyphen XVF M four CD M four. Come here, grab this, bada bing. Come here, grab this, bada bing. Wait for this to be done, and then move on. You need to fan more, fan. Yes, I have a fan right here. And it's not fanning enough. The fan is not fan enough. It takes less time for that to compile than it does for me to pick up my coffee and put it back. Oh, have a drink and put it back down again. Leave the direct. Oh, Leave the directory. Remove the directory. 
Tyler next time for next VF and curses two D and curses. And figure Gork, hopefully. I mean hopefully, I do mean hopefully. We will be at desktop. Well, sorry. We'll be at a this has installed and we are logging into it. I can just see YouTube preview being stupid. I hope it's YouTube preview being stupid and there's not black marks appearing across the top of my page, the top of my stream. Hopefully. Hopefully by the end of the stream, we will be logged in. That is the goal for today. To go from the start to logged in in less than three hours. Now, potentially, in theory, it's possible. I do mean in theory it's possible because I figured out that it takes an hour and a half. No, we didn't. And when I had to swap operating systems, I lost everything. Uh, Seppi. So, yeah. But it only took an hour and a half to go from the start to midway through chapter 8. So time made like 30. With the 30 cores, I reckon it shouldn't take too long. 30 cores and 16 gigs of RAM, I reckon it shouldn't take too long at all. Right, okay, so leave the directory, remove the directory, file the next directory. See, I, can't, I, I, I saved the home directory and then forgot it's not in the home directory. The um, virtual machine is not in the home, was not in the home directory. Meaning, <sighs> Meaning, I had to do it all over again. However, because good CPU now, and it shouldn't take too long, I am happy. But I am happy and confident. This was, won't take long at all. Time next one. Come on. I don't blame you, Mac. And uh, bada bing. Leave the directory. Oh, went down one too far again. Leave the directory. Remove the directory. Ah, uh, next one. That has a patch to it because otherwise it would let me go in first time. It did not. That could mean one of two things. Also, the patches. Patches somewhere. Oh yeah, we don't we don't need the patch now. We need the load other. Oh, got my shoulders. Me elbows, me elbows, my shoulders. Fan more, please. I've noticed this. The fan is more fan when it's in oscillate mode, which is annoying. Because we don't we done the configuration, so I make my J thirty. Install it obviously, come on. Yeah, I I've done that a few times. I've <laughs> made that mistake a few made that mistake a few times when doing uh Linux while doing Arch. So I want to leave the directory, remove the directory. Oh, I didn't do RF. Oh, and this is the long one. Why do I do this to myself? Good. I have an XBF tip utils. Oh, the directory. Enter the directory. Grab. Config. Grab the installing. Will you please fan more? Fan, thanks. Got this heat. What is my heart doing today? Let's find out. 
only 74, that's fine then. Time make try again. Time make minus J30. So and then chuck in the make command or well, the installation commands want to leave the directory, remove the directory. Ah, the next one's type next to be a file. CD file. You know, this isn't bad. We're 35 minutes in and we're nearly all we're nearly at chapter eight. This is not bad at all. Bother. I forget some some of these commands will automatically execute, which is fine, but I wanted to uh Save it. I wanted to change the make option. I'm glad this fan doesn't do heat. Explode the hell that'd make me tired. Oh, the new, the um, new meds that I'm on um, do make me tired and also in. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, it's annoying because it quite literally says. Hang on. Where is it? I need to know. Yeah, I know. Where, where is it? Where's the one I'm looking for? Hang on. Rare. Sounds of infection, severe rash, coughing, black itchiness, heart problems. Nerve problems such as spasms, which I've been having, prolonged bleeding. Yeah, here, here, here's the annoying thing. One of, the, one of the side effects is insomnia and also tiredness. Make it make fucking sense. Insomnia and also tiredness. I'll tell you what, it don't make bloody sense. Uh, I, I also kept this one because I, I actually do need to pay attention to the symptoms for this. Yes, that's annoying. We've done that. Taste. It is a rather whack ass combination, if you ask me. But you need to fan more because I am. Yeah, I am dying in the heat. It's not fun. What was that? Oh, just a warning. That's fine. Oh, and it's a library object. It's a library archive. Which I can then just do that with and then do. Leave the directory. Remove the directory. Tile the next one, tile hyphen XVF. Enter the next one. There. Okay, that's much better. So, uh, so CD find utils. Okay, copy all of this. Bada bing, bada boom. Copy this. So, hopefully. We should get to the uh, logging in. We had issues last time. I got this far. Um, didn't install. Well, it kept kernel panicking. So any operating system that I make is now ha now has to be called kernel panic from scratch. Because I put it to a vote. And you guys voted kernel panic from scratch. I have made one 30. See, any time I make anything, it's kernel panic from scratch. Which I find funny. Leave the directory. So leave the directory. Remove the directory. Ah, the next one's uh, enter the next one. Right, configure, yeah, so time, make component day 30. Oh, the muscle spasms that I'm having, I do not enjoy, because it's, whenever I yawn, muscle spasms in my jaw call me, calls me to chatter my jaw for 20, 30, anywhere between 5 and 30 seconds after the fact, which is annoying. Anyway, so leave the directory, remove the directory, tile the next one. So, tar have an XVF grep. What about that? CD grep.
You know, I'm going to turn it down to two. Okay, one should do for now. Okay, hopefully I'll do. Right. So time makes minus J30. Absolutely flies through. Does that. Leave the directory. Read the directory. Hyphen RF. Tile X, Tile X, GF, GZIP2, GZIP, QD, GZIP. And then, how far through are we? Okay, we're nearly at the uh, tar. I love it how we have to tar the tar directory using tar. So we just done configure, so it doesn't time make minus j30, so time make minus j30. Leave the directory. Remove the directory. Oh, the next directory. Yes. Enter the directory. Oh, this heat's killing me. And you need to be more fan. Lord. It can't be that hot in here, right? Like, honest, honestly. Is it really that hot? <sighs> Is it really that hot in here? Time, no, minus 30. I mean, I know, well, I know for a fact my graphics card isn't that hot. Yeah, I know my graphics card isn't that hot. Doing 33 degrees Celsius, so why the fuck am I dying? Hang on. Neofetch. Oh, oh, yeah, I don't have my custom Neofetch. Oh, I can't see what my CPU is doing because I don't have the Neofetch. Oh, that's annoying. All right, what we've just done, we've done the make do that. So leave the directory, remove the directory. Oh, next on top Hatch, TV, hatch. Bada bing, bada boom. Drop that in. Grab this one. Why did my phone just buzz? I was telling him it's dying. That's why. Okay, I should put. Devil I was looking for. Come here. Put you on chart. Good. Right, there we go. Need to put the phone on chart. Right, okay. Need to configure it. Now it is time. Not one J30. Watch absolutely fly through. Hello, Von Garden. How you doing, my, my friend? Done that, so leave the directory, remove the directory, tar the next one's path, next we have said, cd said. Yeah, I've had a fun week. I had a fun week with the, with the Linux, getting things functional. I'm minus J30. Leave the directory. CD. Mm. Leave the directory. Rem remove the directory. Tar the next one. Tar the next one. We have tar. I must tar the tar file using tar. I like that. I really do. That means we are two from the end. How you doing, my mate? On, like, wanna... How you doing? Things are going alright for you, mate? Oh. I hate these myths. Well, I don't hate them, but it's annoying. That's one of the symptoms. Okay, well, that's one of the side effects, not symptoms. Right, that's done. Leave the directory, remove the directory. Uh, hyphen X, V, F, X, Z, C, D, X, Z.
I'm going to use Dubin Utils Pass 2 because, of course, we need Dubin Utils Pass 2. And the Lord. Right, okay, we're getting there. Time, make minus share. The reason why we're starting again for is because I had to nuke my Ubuntu install because it didn't want to bloody work and I didn't. I did not install Debian 12 when I meant to. And I, I'll be perfectly honest, I didn't want to spend another however long faffing around with the bloody USB stick because Windows wasn't having it. Uh, time, also RM hyphen RF, exit, CD, tar, XVF, and utils. Yep. Does in the end, it doesn't even matter. I tried so hard and got so far. That's, that was the first thing that came to mind when you said that. First thing came to mind. Fuck. That's not good. That's annoying. All right, not much. Uh, I'm guessing it's irrecoverable based off what you based off of the fact you've just said lost. Oh, lost almost eight terabyte. That's not good. What happened if you don't mind if you don't mind me asking? Oh uh, well, that's annoying. Hey, well. At the time, didn't know that'd be a problem, so honestly, good on you. Good on you for taking the wise choice of going encryption at. <laughs> wise choice for going with encrypted, sir. However, fuck. Yeah, GCC, CD, GCC. Oh, did it get one I cried? Okay, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. I was going to say, I've got WannaCry. There was actually someone who managed to make a cure for WannaCry. Ooh. I don't know why that was the first thing that came to mind. I just... Hmm. Hmm. You know, other than the fact I'm currently dying in the heat? Yeah, I don't know why that was the first thing going to mind. Wow, my glasses are soaked. How the fuck? Oh, what's the noise? I feel sorry for you, my man. Wanna Cry was 2019. Hang on. 2018, 2019? That, that's, that's why you don't do it. Was it really that far? Holy hell, was it really that long ago? What the fuck? Mm, I didn't even, didn't even know. God damn. I might have to try that one day. Just have a system. Just have a sandboxed air gapped system. And then you have a have a air gapped sandbox system. 
and just see how many Windows viruses I can get, I can get to work on Linux. That would be pretty cool, actually. It'd be pretty, be pretty interesting, interesting thing to do. Hmm. Consider how many older computers I've just I've just come into like six older computers. Six to older computers. It's possible. I still need to do video on that. It's gonna be Tuesday's video. You need to fan harder, please. Thank you. Please carry on doing your job, thank you. I know I'm talking to my fan, but I'd like to try and treat it nice because it needs to, it's doing its job of trying to keep me cool as I'm dying in the heat from my meds and powerful boy of a computer. It's a powerful beast. <laughs> Thank you for the cold. Right, okay, so we're nearly we're nearly on to chapter eight already, which is pretty damn good considering it's it's already it's already been fifty one minutes. Well, I have to give it a try. I'll have to mess around with mess around with some. Like I'm not gonna do it on this computer. No way, not even inside a virtual machine. Because that's too much of a risk, so I'm probably just going to do it, do it to an air-gapped system, air-gapped sandboxed system. Like once it's got like all all of the um, viruses I want to down want downloaded onto it, such as the good old Bonzi buddy. Yeah, uh, that's uh, that's to shake a few brains, Let's shake up a few memories there. Fucking Bonzi buddy. Now we're just waiting for this final package to be done. Ow. Ow. I'm just waiting for this one. Uh, GCC. GCC. Yeah, GCC to be done. We can move on. I whacked my hand against the door frame. Whacked my knuckles against the door frame yesterday. It's been killing me ever since. Only just scabbed over. Like, I. Well, it was. It was. Uh, I punched the door frame by accident. And I do mean by accident, because I'm running my hand along the wall and just accidentally caught the door frame. And then punched the corner of a light switch. The bloody thing hurt. It's been annoying me since yesterday. It was annoying. Because it's annoying. So of course it's going to be annoying. Yes, Nick. Shut up. We'll get there. Right, I'm taking bets on how far through Chapter 8 we can get. Because if you remember correctly... Hour and a half to get to 8.64 of chapter 8. So, possibly desktop, possibly, not desktop, but possibly logged in, providing I don't fuck it up. Providing I don't mess it up, we should be, we should be fine. Okay. Right, I reckon we should be should be able to get to, uh, through at least the entirety of chapter eight. So leave the directory, remove the directory, move on to the next step, which is entering the two-root environment. Pardon me. Right, we must we must now carry on as root. So let's be logged as root. So we want to exit, and then echo. Well, first make sure it is set, which it still is. Change it to root. Virtual file systems, make them. Mount and bind. Bound, good, good, good. All going well so far. Hopefully we should be in the correct place. Hi, Cal, how you doing, my friend? 
Yes! Oh, okay, we can now start. We can now start the. Good. Last time I was streaming this, I didn't. I had to start twice. Well, I had to start over twice because starting once and then it wouldn't let me log in and then start twice. But the I have no name is entirely expected because there's no passwords or user file, which we are going to do now. We go file system hierarchy notice. Well, st standardization, there's that. That is correct, we'll leave that be. Some of this has changed between uh, LFS version 11.3 and 12, such as this is now formatted different and also longer. That's what she said. Uh, test group, that's fine. We've got to make the test group as is. And if we log into the shell, it should now say root, which it does. Huzzah! That means we're working. That means we're off to the races and actually fucking working. I'm so glad. ETMP. Good. Next, we want to do... Oh. Uh, tar hyphen xvf get text. Oh, hang on. Uh, and then... Tar hyphen xvf get text. CD get text. This is new. Um, in chapter seven, get, compiling packages in chapter seven. That one is a new one. New function of, of version twelve. I don't know why, but it is. I don't make this, so I just know it's a new function. But we're getting through. I'm also dying in the heat. Enjoy. Yeah, dying in the heat is not fun. The fan is doing its it's doing its hardest. To keep me cool. It really is, but I need an I ideally need a power, much more powerful one. Or I stick my fan in the face stick my face in the direction of the exhaust of a jet engine. Yes, stick my fan in the face of a jet engine. No. I need to stick my face in the exhaust of a jet engine to cool down. That's why I speak English. I promise. <laughs> I promise I speak English. I really do. Right. I hope the eight of you are doing well so far. I hope you all have a wonderful day. I really do. But we're getting through this. Uh, I can't remember. What's the standard build? 1.1. 1 .1. So this is taking a while. Oh, that's the config. That's the configuration. Of course, that's the configuration. Yeah, just chuck 30 calls at it. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. No, it'll get no more than, what, 68 degrees. Because last time, if we remember, we managed to break NeoFetch because it said, it said 63 degrees, 6 degrees. My, my CPU somehow just took a nosedive and went to 6 degrees Celsius. Don't know how, don't know why, not going to question it, it just did. We do not question things we do not know, we do not understand. It'll be fine, I promise. As long as it works. It'll be fine. Never question something that just that just works. I will Todd Howard this. It just works. We will get this to just work. I'm going to do that every time now. Hopefully this works because it should just work. Oh, damn. Yes, hopefully we should be in a decent place for getting this functional. And then once we get moving again, we should be good. I've got a drink over there that I really want to have. But I will have that in a moment. We just on map, drop them in, leave the directory, remove the directory, tar the next one. Enter the next one, CD Boston. Why do I? Oh, yes, because I've been utils, that's why. No, I got myself a can of Dr. Pepper Zero there. I want it, but I can't have it until I've finished Chapter 7. Which is, again, not too long. We are now, diddly dee, how far through Chapter 7 are we? We are at Bison, so we've got one, two, three, four. And then clean up the temporary file system. We've got not long left, which is good. Um, no, I'm not going to be making a backup. Why? Because, screw it. 
minus 30 because I have the CPU power to not need to bother about making a backup. So leave the directory, remove the directory. Ah, so the next one, tar, tar next one. Enter next one. It's annoying because we're in the scenario where it's taking longer to do the configuration than it is actually to bloody compile and install, which is annoying. But I love it. <laughs> because beforehand, uh, it would take me longer to do the building than it would, the uh, compiling of the package than it, would, than it would with compilation instructions. Now the compilation instructions take even longer. Will take a long time because, well, they can. And they do. Which is annoying, but it'll be fine. And remember, whilst we wait, we must hydrate. So, find something liquid and that is consumable and consume it. Just like I have. But time, make minus. As long as it is consumer, as long as it is safe for human consumption, drink it. And you'll be fine. Meanwhile, this fan needs to start fanning better, although doing a good job. And we will be off to the races soon with the end of chapter 8. Python does take a little bit of time. Uh, shouldn't... This is not a 0 0.6 standard build unit package, so I don't know what the hell you're cracking on about, Pearl. But you ain't 0 0.8 standard... 0 0.6 standard book SBU. We're not, we're, here's the thing. We're not going to run any of the safety tests this time around. Not even the ones that say critical. We are going to go balls to the wall. We're going to do this. We're going to raw dog this. RM hyphen R. Pearl leads right to remove the directory tiles next to Hyphen. Yeah, we're not. We're not messing around with this. This one this time around. We are. We will not be running any of the tests even on one that say they are critical we are going to do going to run all the way through with no tests at all why because i li like to live on the edge and the tests can sometimes take up to 20 minutes and i ain't about to, i ain't about to sit there through 20 minutes worth of tests so no it's fine time make a minus check even with the 30 calls, it still, it still takes time, which is annoying, to say the least. So we're not, we're not running any security tests, we're just going to go safety tests even. We're just going to go straight through, because what's the worst that can happen? It doesn't boot. That's easy. We can fix that by doing it again. Because it doesn't take that long anymore. Time, make minus check 30. Previously, I would have. Ah. Yeah. I'm make install. Let me do that one. Previously, on my slower CPUs, I would have done the security tests, well, safety tests, to make sure it was all installed. Now, nah. I got, I got a decent enough CPU. I don't need to worry about it. Ah, hyphen R, Python, R hyphen X via text info, text info, CD, text info. If you hear any, if you hear like slight beeping every now and then, and now and again, that's my computer telling me what I've just tried to do is not happening. Because the edge of that case, it came with a speaker built in. Because there's a speaker header pins on my motherboard. Speaker's plugged in. So anytime I try and do something that the computer doesn't like, such as backspacing the line that's already backspaced to the max, you know, motherboard just makes the speaker go beep. Makes it beep every time. And I find that... I love that. It's it's just like nope, mm -mm. not today. It's just an audible. Why are you trying to do that? It's funny. I like it. It's nice. All right. So I want to leave the directory, move the directory, tar the next one. I've got to be open to Linux. Be the util. Did you finish what you're planning on doing there, Peter? Thank you very much, Peter. I'll let you know how it went. 
Did you finish what you're doing there? But this heat's murder, I swear to God. Good. I make my shit, eh? Ooh, I'll have, I'll, I'll tell you what, I'll have a look when I'm done. How about that? So, I make my sword. See, that should have taken a minute 45 how to use one core. That did it in 5.5 seconds. It's very really nice. Uh, going well so far. Uh, this is this is the actual proper legit release version of Slurps from Scratch. Because version 12 was released on the 1st of September, which was yesterday. So we, know, we, know, we are no longer using the release candidate. We're just using the main version. Uh, we're starting again because I had to nuke my system and then we lost uh, most of it. We lost all my virtual machines. So RM hyphen R util Linux. And now we're moving on to the cleaning up of the temporary file system. Huzzah. Saves about three or thirty five megabytes from this. Uh I, I like it. Uh I, I used Debian before I used Ubuntu. So I, I was all I always had a soft spot for Debian. And I know for a fact that it works. Now that I have a graphics card that should work, we should be fine. Okay, we are now at the start of chapter 8. Okay, here comes the hell. Here comes the hell, right. Man pages, tar-xbf. Man pages. Man pages, CD man pages. Yay. I I meant to go for Debian twelve, but I um, accident without realizing, accidentally downloaded Debian eleven, went to my USB stick, then installed it without realizing. I then got it to Debian. It's like ah, oh, that's Debian eleven. I don't care. I like Debian eleven. I know it works. What's the problem? There isn't one. Anyway, did I run that? Run it yet, so leave the directory, remove the directory. Oh, next one type next to the IANA. Do the IANA. These are the internet naming people. Leave the directory. Leave the directory. Oh, next to the FGLibc. Here comes the first big one. And Pancake Sparkle, we are. We're risking it for a biscuit this time around. We are going to go balls to the wall. We're going to absolutely raw dog this like raw dog in our mental health. And we are not running the security tests. We're not running the safety tests. CD, GLBC. This is true. I should be able to. Yes, we're not doing the safety tests. We're raw, we are raw dogging this like we're raw dogging our mental health. Balls to the wall, all or nothing. No tests, not even for the critical stuff. We're just going straight in without, without checking anything. I meant minus J30. Okay. Uh, well, yeah, why not? Oh, yeah, I bought a new SD card for the uh, Dying Pi, by the way, Peter. So uh, at some point in time, I've got to redo all of that and figure out which Pi it is. It'll be the Pi 2, won't it? No, it'll be the Pi 3. It's got the um, Zabbix proxy on it. Yeah, it'll be the Pi 2 that's got the Xamax proxy on it. But yes, this will, t this will cut out like a decent... It's cut out about 10-15 minutes worth of compilation time. Which will be nice. It will be very nice to have, I will admit. Right, so... I'm at minus J30. Touch. Do that. I make install. 
fix hard coded path, we will. Yeah, why not? You want me to potentially kill your system? Just don't check to see if it's there. Just go, eh, it'll be fine. The bane, the, 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 the most said phrase in any tech, in any IT support support person's life. What could go wrong? Have you tried turning it on and off again? Is it plugged in? What do you mean you've forgotten your password? You set it two days ago. No, that's not supposed to go in there. Why are you doing that? I am IT support. I'm not here to fix the fridge. Why is the router on top of the microwave? And so on. I was just thinking. I just come up with various things. What do you mean you put... We're not doing... Oh yeah, these are the optimal locales. We're not doing all of them because we're going to be here for an age. Yeah, I still need to make that new cable. <laughs> I still haven't done it yet. I, I probably will do it at some point. Uh, I'm guessing a lot. A lot recently because I've been spending some time fucking around getting computer working. I'm going to guess 43 times. God damn these meds. Okay, good. I'm gonna guess for ah. I w see, I wasn't. I wasn't that far off. Do that. Time zone is Europe, London. Europe, London. Nope, I don't need to do that. So it is part of being time zone info. It is Europe, London. Grab this, bada bing, bada boom. Canada, Eastern. Nope. Bada bing. Right, so leave the directory, remove the directory. On to the next one. So tar hyphen xvf zlib. CV zlib. Right, how many packages are we looking at for chapter 10? 79 packages, okay. That's what we've got to deal with. So, once we've done that, we need to... Okay, good. I was about to say, please tell me I did that. I did. Okay, I did. I just had to make sure. Alright, <laughs> Zlib. This is gonna be easy as something. I make my shit say. Shouldn't take too long. We're not testing anything. We, yeah, we're not testing anything today. We're just going balls to the wall. Even the critical ones, we're ignoring the critical runs. It's just that sometimes it just has swap issues. Did I do that? Yeah, I did so. So leave the directory, remove the directory. Tarlet's tarlet, let's see if these are two. Aha! Dots, that means it's got a patch file, so. Well, it's not so bad then. Well, the new SD card I bought for it is a class 10 one, so that's actually designed for what I wanted to do. Compared to it not being. So, hmm. ah, okay, that's weird. You know, what? I'm not going to question it. I make one just say. Right, but hopefully, well, this one, this part's going to take a while. Uh, if I can get down a package forty-two by. 
hour 45, I'll be happy. Done. A useless, useless static library. Hi, that's me. I'm a useless, useless static library. I know a lot of. I, I know. A sp I'm a sponge for information. I stay still a lot. Static library. Leave the directory. Remove the directory. Tar next from basic two. So tar hyphen next to the FFZ. Also, welcome back, by the way, Ben. CDXZ. I hear my phone go buzz buzz, but it hasn't passed through the more, so it can't be that important. Because if it was important, it would have been passed through the more. Ah, that's not a good thing. Figure no. So, I make one shot 30. So I make install. Use the directory. Remove the directory. Tile next to Z standard. CD Z standard. Make the prefix. Oh, I did not do that. Expected only fail in all caps as a failure. Oh, bother. Right, well, we have to wait for that. Whilst we wait, we must hydrate. Oh. The glasses. Glasses are not agreeing with the amounts with my new meds because also the amount of heat coming off of me is just fogging them up. Ah, oh, God. I wonder where Mislav is. I wonder where Mislav is. It's not like Mislav to go this long without watching the stream unless he's having a busy day. He might be at work, mind. But still, I wonder where Mislav is. It's not like Mislav to not be here. Miss Love, if you're watching or you end up watching the vlog, hi mate. Where are you? Are you okay? It's not like Miss Love to go this long. Oh well. I hope you come. Right. Let's carry on. We're just, uh, where are we? Um, oh yeah, because I didn't... I didn't do the thing I should have done. Alright, so. Install the package. Yeah, he might be spending time with his wife. Which again, is fine. It's just, it just hasn't turned up at all. So I just... Hmm. Uh, yeah, it could be that. Or he's busy at work. Just, it's not like him. Z standard, tar hyphen... Uh, so... RM hyphen R, Z standard, tar hyphen XBF file. CD file. You said that the first time, Peter. But also, thank you very much for coming on, my friend. You sleep well, my guy. And show us photos of your walls painted tomorrow we we will watch your paint dry with you so time make minus j30 i just love how fast that is leave the directory remove the directory ah uh, the next one i have going to be f read line dot star which means it's got a patch file CD read line. Enter the directory. Right. We've done the patch. Now we need to prepare for compilation. Compile the package. Right. So. I make minus J30. Apply through, which is done. Install. We will install the documentation because at some point we're probably going to need it because I'm a dumb. All right. Leave the directory. Remove the directory. Tile the next one. Tile the next one. M4. Ah, hello, M4. We're back at you. CD. Enter the directory. Let's get it started. Okay. A lot of this is copy and paste and I'm getting rather I'm getting fast at it. I might actually attempt to well there is an automated version of this called uh ALFS. <laughs> Watch it. Watch it. Remember what happened last time? I actually did that by accident. Watch it. <laughs> oh god. That was fun. 
Oof, I, um, I, I, was, I reached for six there for a second. I really did. Watch it. <laughs> Leave the directory, remove the directory, tar the next one. If BC, CDBC. It's funny because um, for people that don't know, I, I used to be on a older CPU that only had, that I could only give six calls to a virtual machine. Okay. And so it used to be time make minus J6. Every single time. Except the one time I did minus J7. Install. Leave the directory. Leave the directory. So I, uh, it's become a. Uh, Von Garden has picked it up. Or Darius Roos. I still remember your name, mate. Yeah. He's interesting. Uh, Tarf and XVF Flex. Hmm. Oh, these meds are playing hell. Oh, God, my jaw. These meds be playing hell with my jaw. I'm not cold, it's just my bloody meds. Yeah, that, that, that did cause a fun time in the virtual machine and computer because they started screaming at me. He's like, we aren't supposed to do that. I'm like, I'm sorry. I promise not to do it again. And now I'm just like, hmm, six cores. How measly. Have 30. I still haven't tried to build a LFS with my, virtual, uh, with my server yet. Now, I imagine if I did that, it might be faster than this, but only just because that has 24 calls. This has. No, this will be faster because this has got 30. That's only got 24. Well, this, this has 32 because it's 16 hyperthreaded up to 32. That's only got 24. This is faster than my server. <laughs> oh my God, this is faster than my server. I just realized that. Oh God. That's hilarious. Um, you've got to do it on... I can't do it on your behalf. I don't, I don't know. Um, if it's been more than 10 working days since um, you've ordered it, they will refund you your shipping. So I would send off an email. But, but bearing in mind, it could take 24 business hours for them to respond. Oh, oh! Isn't um Kaylee your funky Dutch friend? Yeah, I know. Yeah, just teespring. Teespring will take up to twenty-four business hours to respond. Just say three fucking days. Just say. Three business days instead of twenty-four business hours. Fuck. Right. Okay. Um. Hang on. Log in with this. Because. You. Right. So, um, this. I use that. Oh, I, I'm gonna move. I'm gonna move away from Teespring once I can, because I need to shout at the other up the other YouTube integration option because they try to tell me that the Tux logo is copyrighted, which it's not. Well, Tux is not copyrighted. It's, Tux doesn't actually belong to the Linux Foundation. It doesn't belong to them. It belongs to the person who made it. So I need to have a word with Spreadshop. Or I'm going to start doing, making it all myself. Because that's the only way I can see how. Right, okay. Uh, uh, hyphen XVF tickle. 
CD, PCL. Like, here's the thing. If it, if I get merchandise ordered, if you guys want me, want merchandise from me, and I can do it myself, I will start doing it myself. I will absolutely start doing it myself. What was the top of the screen going black? Um, that? It's not you, mate. I th I think I might be asking too much of YouTube. Or OBS, I don't know. Let me just check. Let me just uh, view the stats doc. No, it's you. It's uh it's OBS. It's OBS because Bearing in mind I'm streaming at 60 FPS, I've lost 3% of frames, which is equivalent to 24,700 frames. Due to rendering lag. What do you mean, rendering lag? I'm, I'm, I'm using the settings you recommended, OBS. What do you mean, render... Mm. Mm. Oh, I know why. It's because the encoders aren't enabled. Because the encoders didn't want to work. I'm going to install OBS from the source instead of through FlatHub. Hello. I'm going to Ah. I need to run that again. That's done. No, it's because um, it doesn't, it's a, uh, it directed me to the NVIDIA website for the drivers that I tried to install the other day. But it didn't want to install. For no reason. It does not, it does not like an X interface. So it wouldn't install. So I've got to do it through the console. Apparently, which is annoying because it does not want to work for me, do da. Yes, documentation. Leave the directory, remove the directory. Oh, the next one. I expect the expect to work. Yeah, this time it's not an OBS error, it is just down to NVIDIA drivers being. Absolute ass. I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna be the one to say it. There is, but it didn't. That's the thing. I installed them via the command line. I actually got it off the repo, but guess what? No. Because here's the. Here, where is where's my terminal? Okay, because here's the thing. NVIDIA Corporation GA104. NVIDIA Corporation 242487. Do you see my problem here? Yeah. You see the problem here? So... Because it can. I... I don't know. Also, I need to change that. Yep, NVIDIA Corp device 2487. I don't know why it does that. But the packages are installed because I have... I have the NVIDIA X server settings. And the drivers are installed. But they're not according to OBS. Which means I need to install OBS raw instead of through FlatHub. <sighs> God love it. I love it. Thanks, Nvidia. I, I, here's the thing. I'm going to be the one. I'm going to be the first one to say this. Nvidia and AMD drivers for Linux are ass. They don't work. I said what I said. 
they do not work as intended no matter how good they try and think they are they do not function as intended they work but when you want to do some more more detailed stuff with them that's when things start like just like installing the drivers for starters they're both shit you've got to go to a, a, a um, user maintains repository amd and nvidia drivers for their graphics cards are absolute ass i said it For example, the F I I had to stop using Debian because their their drivers for the RX sixty six hundred XT didn't want to work. I couldn't even log in when I, when I installed the R my RX sixty six hundred XT before it died into the motherboard. Couldn't even log in. It just constant cycle of I, I plug it in i i try like several different desktop environments not a single one of them could i get past the login screen not a single one second i took it back out and put put in my rx 550 no issues put in the rx 6600 xt didn't want to work the, R the rtx 3060 put it in no issues Nothing at all. Uh, before I'd even installed the drivers, it was working. So, I don't know. Right. Okay. So, we've done. I think we did that. So, uh, we're now to leave the directory. Remove the, di uh, remove the directory. Let's have the next one. Jaganu, which is I can't remember. Deja vu, I've just been to space before. I'm on the street. Because I I'm of the opinion of you use what works for you. I don't care what you use. Does it work? If it does work, yeah. If it works for you, good. Good. I don't. I've said it before, and I'll say it again. I do not understand the elitism that some people have over their operating systems. I'm not saying you have it. Definitely not saying you have it. Definitely not saying you're elitist about it either. But I do not understand the elitism that people have over their operating systems. It makes no sense. It makes no sense to me. And I'm of the opinion of you use what you use. If it works for you, good. Stop trying to force it on everyone else. You use what works. Helping somebody by going, well, this this works here, or this particular uh, this particular operating system works with these bits of tools that you would like to use. So, I recommend you use this. Or instead of everyone going, mm, use Arch. Also, no, I'm not going to show you how to install it. Meh. What the fuck? The goal is to try, like the, the overall goal of the Linux community is to try and be more accepted into the consumer market other than android and the most of the internet by doing what people do by the elitists being like they are it's not helping us it's not did i prepare that joke okay yeah i did uh, I didn't need to test it anyway, so it's fine. Bin utils, okay. Uh, so, tar hyphen xvf bin utils. Cd bin utils. But people. People's insistence on their elitism does not help us it hurts us it hurts us as a community it makes game developers not want to develop for us and it just doesn't work we are here to help one another not shit on one another
I have not, and that sounds like horror. No thanks. Oh joy, no thanks. It's like, I don't agree with the elitism. I don't. Uh, and sorry if I scared you off there, Pancake Sparkle. <laughs> oh, that's annoying. I have tried to do IPA, though. Exactly. At the end of the day, it is all Linux and we all use it. We all use it at the end of the day, and that's the main thing. I've just realised why I might be having some uh, frame skip due to, to rendering lag. You may notice a little FPS 60. Yeah, I'm doing this at 60 FPS. Because graphics card will let me do it. OBS, please explain to me how the bitrate is going above 10 kilobits per second. 10,000 megabytes a second, considering you're limited down to 10. The bitrate is limited to 10,000 kilobits per second, which is 10 megabytes. Explain to me how the hell you've just gone to 10,285. 10,449. Oh my god, OBS, that's not how you do that, mate. You are limited for a reason, that doesn't mean go above it. Ah, this is annoying. That's a good point. I want to see what my network usage is. What's my network usage like? Okay, it's about anything. At the end of the day, it's all Linux. We all use it. That's... We are all working in a collective goal to get somewhere. That's the main thing. We're not here, we're here to help. We're not here to shit. I am here to help. Such as the start of the uh, operating systems, it's attempting to make kernel panic from scratch. The install scripts that I've made, the guides, the videos, so everything that I do is all aimed to help someone. If I can help one person, then I've done my job. But I've helped 1,107 1, of you. At least, because you know how? That's how many subscribers I have. Sub subscribers. I will get there eventually. 1,110. Oh, that's gone up. It's gone up three from earlier. That's nice. Very nice. But yes, I've helped one. I ha I've helped at least 1,110 of you. And that. I like that. As long as I can help one person. I've done my job. I've done it effectively. I'll admit, I would like more subscribers, but I'm happy. I'm happy to be actually earning and doing and making and helping. Mm. Oof. God damn. Oh, God. Here comes to. Uh, thank you. Muscle spasms in my jaw. It's not fun. Mm, stop buzzing at me that much. Damn it. Hmm. Bunch of Let's turn that down. Right, this is annoying. I don't know why this is taking a while. It's because it's a 2.2. That's why. Did I just paste that in without actually checking it? Potentially did, didn't I? I probably did, didn't I? Hang on, where is it?
Not quite. No. Build, yeah, that's, so that's fine. That's the compilation instructions. Where is it? Uh, no, not there. Where are you? Yep. This is why I like having a mouse that just scrolls infinitely. God damn this heat. Heat's murder. Heat's murdering me, man. Oh god. There we go. So, we have to remember to install wget today as well, which means we also have to install, install the three packages that go with wget. Such as make CA 1.4, something and something. I can't remember what the other two are, but they, they overline each other, which gets annoying very quickly. I'm not tired, it's just the side effects of my meds, don't worry. Yeah, this is it. This, don't worry, I'm, I'm not going to fall asleep on you this time. I've already done that once. Mm. Mm. <sighs> mm. I'm not going to fall asleep on you this time, don't worry. Oh god, I hate that. Spasms in my jaw are not fun. Right. Okay, come on. Hurry up. Okay, we'll leave you there for timing. We've got to turn it off for now. Right, okay, so we need to install wget so we can actually download things. Um, with wget, there's a few things that we can't install uh, that we need certificates for that we can't get because we don't have wget installed. So, but to install wget, to download the things, we need PID1 to launch. But to download things, we need to be not, we need to be in the true root environment. But, well, we need to be in the true root environment with internet which we can't do that because when we're in the true root environment pid1 is not launched and pid1 is the kernel it's like the main boot and without pid1 we can't do anything at all why are you taking so bloody long man it's only 3.3 sorry it's only 2.2 why the jesus are you taking so long ah, it's because i did it with that aye aye, aye. Did it the wrong way. Bloody around, that's way. Hey, let me good. Right, let's not make that mistake again, shall we? Okay. So. Leave the directory. Remove the directory. Ah, have an XVF. GMP, CD, GMP, or gross military product. If you played the game Metal Gear Solid 5, Phantom Pain. Which I have, I very much enjoy it. We will do that just in case. Failed. Oh well, I can suck my nuts. Right. Run this through. Make it and the documentation. We are skipping the test results because we are absolutely risking it for a biscuit and going balls to the bloody wall. Okay? I'm going balls to the wall today. We are absolutely bloody risking it. I make minus J30. Out. It took longer to it took long, it, This is one of those few times I love. It's like it takes longer to actually make the bloody thing than it does to set it up, which is hilarious. Right. Leave the directory, remove the directory. Ah, the next entire MPFR. Do the MPFR. 
What do we have here, MPFR? Are you very far? Hello, Mohammed Sami. How are you doing? So I am going through and making a Linux from scratch system. This is the Linux from scratch resource book, which lets you make your own Linux operating system. Uh, I'm doing the system D version. There's also a system V init version you can do. Uh, I, it's just, I've always, uh, I've been doing system uh, Linux from scratch for quite a while because of the YouTube channel and I'm just making a system. Uh, so far we're going through chapter eight and doing the uh, in, we are making the operating system now. I was doing all the packages that I needed for the basis of running the operating system. And because of that, this one does, this chapter it does take a little while because it's a list of 79 packages, which basically do all the running on the operating system. So that's what we're currently doing right now. Uh, we're not, uh, as we've already established, I'm not run, even running the tests this time around. Move the directory, move the directory. Ah, the direct, next one, MPC, CD, MPC. Hmm, I don't know. That's why. It's uh, MPC and MPFR, that's why I didn't do it immediately. So time make minus j30 and then HTML. Also welcome along by the way, mate. HTML install leave the directory, remove the directory. Uh the next one's high XF ATTR CD ATTR Linguas. Want to do time make minus j30. Time make install. Leave the directory, remove the directory, ta the next one. So tar hyphen VF ACL linguas or languages. The uh, C D linguas. Oh, not linguas, ACL, not Brain, please engage. Thanks. Honestly, it just feels like I'm just shoving my head into a void. So we've done done the configuration options, so time make minus shit thirty. Want to do time make install. This doesn't need 30 calls to install, it'll be fine. Leave the directory, remove the directory. Libcap's a new one, if I remember correctly. Part for version 12. Next we have libcap. CD libcap. Want to grab this, bada bing. It's not a stupid question at all. Uh, I don't know what Yocto is. Uh, this is, you make it yourself entirely. From scratch. And once you're done, you can install anything you want onto it. I've got everything so. Ah. Oh, Yocto is for embedded devices. This is just all around your own operating system. I, I just gave it a quick look there. Uh, this is not, this is just running uh, raw on a virtual machine. Um, not on an embedded device, which reminds me, I, because I've recently come into some computers, I might actually just try Linux from scratch build on one of them. It's going to be a horror. It's going to be horror. Because I rolled. Uh, Leave the directory, remove remove the directory, uh tar next one, lib cap, r hyphen x lib x crypt, that's also a new one. Library x crypt, that's new. Disable failure tokens. So time make minus j30. The reason why it's minus j34 is that is the to specify the amount of calls this virtual machine has 30 calls available to it instructions above disabled the obsolete api functions since no package installed by compiling from sources would link them to the runtime however 
Uh, the only known binary applications that link these functions require AB, ABI version 1, which must have, if you must have such functions. So I'm going to chuck that in as a just in case so I don't have any issues, because I don't know if I'm going to need it or not. The smallest operating, the smallest Linux from scratch system that was made was four megabytes, either four or eight megabytes in size. And that was specifically just for web hosting. But the more you know. Leave the directory, remove the directory. Tile X from type and XVF shadow. The shadow. Eight point two six is starting to get through. We're not going to we're not going to install Cracklib this time. We're not going to do Cracklib. For some reason, yeah. We are not doing Cracklib support this time around anyway. Right, okay, let's go. So, uh time now we've done this, we need to do time. Let's just 30. And that. Configuring shadow. Shadowed. Wait, hang on. I didn't do crack liver, did shadowed though. I, I honestly don't know. I really don't. I don't, I don't know myself either. I know it's for the amount, to specify the amount of calls, but why? Mm -hmm. I don't know. I need to make sure that there's a number on the numpad. So. Right, so. Good. Oh, okay. That's cool. Uh, on your Gen 2 spin, including Oh My Bash. Uh, what is Oh My Bash? Because I actually don't know. Unless I have seen it and I'm just being dumb. Never mind, I've seen it and I'm just being dumb. I've, I have seen it, I'm just being dumb. It's fine. It's fine, I'm just dumb. Leave the directory, remove the directory. Oh, next. Oh, this one's going to be a long one. For, yeah, 42 standard build units. No. We are not doing the tests. Oh, my ZSH. Yeah, I, I see what you mean now. I was just being dumb. Because I've not used it before, that's why. She had me confused. So, time, make, minus J30. Let's see how long this, is, this thing is going to bloody take. We will increase the stack size. But we are not going to be running the tests. We're just going to increase stack size, install, carry on through. Because we are risking it for a biscuit today. We are not doing the tests. We're doing none of the tests, even the critical ones. We're, we are ignoring every test. Hey, what works? I mean... I got mine. So why not? Whatever works for you. Mine is an early 2015 MacBook Pro, the uh, model right before the butterfly key switches, which is the dodgy one. But this one's fine. Although it could do it could do with having another battery, having the battery replaced. Something I recently learned about the um, new MacBooks is now the screen, like the physical panel, is serialized to the motherboard. 
the panel is serialized now. Why? Why is the panel serialized? Like, why? The only way to fix it is just take the chip and put it on the new... Just... It's not that fucking hard. Apple, come on. It's annoying is what it is. They've gone downhill. They've really gone downhill since Jobs died. They really have. They've gone massively downhill since, Bill, uh, since Steve Jobs died. I mean, granted, he'll be extremely happy about the fact that the richest company in the world. However, for them, oh. there's been quite there's a fair few interesting stories behind Apple. I, I can tell one of them whilst we're waiting for this. So, the original iPhone, when it was being developed, because there's a few stories behind it, um, when the original iPhone was being developed, the people who were working on it had no idea what they were making. No idea at all. So, and I do mean it, because the, the team, like the people making it, all separated into different teams. They had no idea what they were doing or what they were making. So, and they were told, you'll find out what you're making at the keynote. So if I remember correctly, it was the 2005 WWDC, uh, Worldwide Developer Conference. And Steve Jobs unveiled the iPhone, just like he did with the iPod. And said, this is what we're releasing. It is a phone from Apple. Okay, I stand corrected. But when it was released, they were, uh, no, you know, they started in 2005, I think it was. But they were, the teams were told, you don't know what you, you just make it, make the thing, go, go do it, go make the thing. And I had no idea what they were doing. But if you go, if you, if you go on your phone now and you know how you scroll, like you scroll to the bottom, bottom of the top of a list and you just see like a little bubble come down from the top of the scroll. That was actually a thing. That was actually Steve Jobs. Steve Jobs pointed that out to one of the software engineers and said, what well, has the, has the software just died? I, it's not it's not moving anymore like i can't tell has has, has the software just died like, no it's just you're at the end of the list well how am i supposed to tell like there's, there's no like there's no response there's, there's nothing here fix it so whenever you scroll to the top of top of bottom of the list on a phone it will show like a little bubble like moving up just like hey look you're at the end of the list that all because steve Jobs said i don't like it fix it Something as simple as that, we all now have. The pattern for the, uh, for the iPad, if I remember correctly, it was six, they got it six years before the thing was actually bloody released. The iPod, they were told the 1.3 inch hard drives, they were made specifically by Toshiba for Apple. And the reason why the iPods went from physical hard drives to flash media is because Toshiba said, we're not making these drives anymore. Sony, you and Sony are our, were our only customers. Sony has now stopped buying them off of us. We're going to stop making them now. You need to move to Flash. So they moved to Flash. But a, a thousand songs, they did no market research. They just, Apple did what Apple does best and said, it's going to be a desirable product. And yeah, it wasn't wrong. It, that, people desired it. People wanted it. <laughs> So they got it. But he, he did a lot. He did a lot of good for that company when he was still in charge. And then he died. Now it's gone to shit. Because if you notice something, when Steve Jobs was ousted the first time around, uh, L lib 64 LV 86 6 Ah, uh, correct. Good. Right. I didn't run the security. I didn't run the safety test with this. Requesting program interpreter lib 64 LD 86 LD X 86 64 SO2. I didn't run the safety tests. And everything that we want is working. I'm not saying 
don't run the safety test, it's just it worked without running the safety tests. I didn't need to do anything, like everything's working. Succeeded, good. Good. But it's working. Yes, yeah, because it didn't uh, run safety check. Sanity check, even. I need to see it much quicker. Uh, how long was it? I'll tell you in a second once I get to it. Where is it? Oh god, where is it? You know, it doesn't matter. It took barely any time. Uh, I say Linux because I am not an elitist. Because I see someone who goes, Actually, it's GNU Linux. Just, no. It's Linux. We all know it's GNU Linux. Shut up. It is GNU Linux. It's Linux. We know. We all know it's GNU Linux, but we, go, we call it Linux. Leave it alone. We don't need to call it GNU Linux every single bloody time. Remove the directory. Uh, hyphen XVF package config. CD package config. Actually, it's GNU Linux. GNU stands for I GNU. I don't know because I'm an ass and I don't remember. So, yeah, I, I just. Mm. I, I don't. I don't like it. I don't like that people do that. Actually, I make minus J thirty. It does. Burb. Everybody's heard about the word. Burb, 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 burb. But is the word. I make install. Yes, see why? Yeah, no. You just put, you just stick yourself out like a massive fucking know it all asshole. Nah. Nah. Never say GNU Linux. You'll point yourself out like an idiot. Or someone who's trying to know it all. Don't. So leave the directory, remove the directory. For your own sanity, don't. <laughs> Trust us. Don't. Uh, tar hyphen xvfn curses. bbn curses. Grab everything here. Yeah, don't. Your insanity, don't. Right, whilst we do this, we're going to pour ourselves a drink. I will admit, these with these new meds, I'm still getting used to the fact that my brain's silent for a change. It, it, it's weird. I'm not sure I like it. How to start a bar of... <laughs> Just walk in and say, RM hyphen RF hyphen hyphen no preserve hyphen root. I use Linux. Sorry, I use GNU Linux. Mm. Uh, no! Shut up! Bad! It's not sudo, it's sudo. Or it's do as. No, it's sudo. Not it. Stop. It is sudo. It is not Ubuntu. It's not Ubuntu. I've heard people call Ubuntu Ubuntu before. Ah! Uh. I've heard people call it Ubuntu Ubuntu. It's not Ubuntu. Oh my god. Right, okay. Where was I? I make minus J30. Like that annoyed me. Mm. 
Ubuntu. 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 Yeah, it's Ubuntu. But yes, Ubuntu. No, no. <laughs> you, you, sir, committing war crimes. Go away. Stop. Bad. You, 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 collective punishment is a war crime, sir. Stop doing that. Collective punishment of protected parties is a war crime. Please stop doing that. Thank you. We will install the extra documentation. We'll run this. Yes, collective, collective punishment is a war crime. Please stop. Thank you. <laughs> oh, Lord. Pierre Jacques omelette du fromage. Cheese omelette. A Pierre Jacques cheese omelette. Right. Leave the directory. Remove the directory. Good luck with that one, by the way. I do genuinely mean it. Good luck. I'll have an XVF instead. Do these said. Right, so again, we're not going to do the testers. It's taking a bit longer than I thought it would. You know, what? it's fine though. Actually, I think we're I think we're at about roughly the same point we were last time. Tear up. Now let me check. Let me check. Eight point four two. Okay. Oh, right. They really are. And with Manjaro just shitting on them, didn't help at all. Really did not help. Right, okay. Um, sorry, I was just needing to read something that was a rather urgent message. Right, okay, configure. So, time, make J30. Time, make my J30, HTML. Uh, we will not do tester. We'll just install. So, leave the director. Yes, that works. Uh, leave the directory, remove the directory. Ta, 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 ta. Have, uh, I think it's PS misc. Really PS misc. Oh, I made a video on one. I made a video on one. Oh, what was it? What was it? Playlists. Um. God, what, oh, what was it? Um, it's actually post one. Uh. No, do I really have two pages worth of um, two pages worth of operating systems? What the place? God damn. Um. Maybox. I saw Maybox. That that was a nice one to use. Honestly, the UI, the, mm, it was so nice to use. Mailbox was really nice to use, I will admit. That's, Mailbox was a nice one. So, time, make. Okay, 30. Leave a directory, remove the directory. Oh, let's see. Oh, next VF, get text. UV, get text.
Yeah, see that? That should be on an auto renew. It really should be. The fact I didn't is just concerning. Concerning they didn't auto renew it. Well, thank you much for coming along, mate. Thank you for your time. Yeah. Yeah, that definitely doesn't help either. Definitely does not help. Buzz buzz to you too, fine. Come on. Good, done. I don't know. I, I, oh, I haven't used Pine Phone, so I don't know. I plus, I've not. I've also not looked into it. So, I'm not doing the checks. Yeah, I, I don't know. Like, I'd like to be able. To, I'd like to be able to make my own. Or do an equivalent pine phone, but out of like a general, like commercially available one. Like, don't get me wrong, pine phone is commercially available, it's just ava more available, you know. That's like for down the line. Ugh. This is true. Right. Come on, hold on, there we go. Hang on. Hello. Warren, how you doing? How you doing, Warren? How you doing, mate? Sorry. Just uh, message that you did a drum response. All right, bada bing, bada boom, bada done. Yeah, uh, Ubuntu got nuked. Well, Ubuntu wouldn't boot ever. Ooh, that I, that I have also heard about. Pardon me, sorry about that. Leave, leave the directory, remove the directory. Tell the next one. We have. I'm now okay. We have 47 minutes to get through the uh, rest of chapter eight. We should be able to do it. Ah, oh, hyphen XVF Bison CD Bison. We should be able to get through the entirety for the through the rest of chapter eight. Okay, we're not quite halfway through yet. We need to be at lib FFI to be halfway through. I mean, you're going to need luck for that one, mate, yeah. Uh, I don't have an Intel Arc GPU, so I can't tell you. I'm having our bison, tar hyphen XVF, grep, CD grep. Wait, did I install that? Please tell me I installed it. I did. <laughs> I couldn't tell if I, well, if I installed it there.
Yeah, sounds like a plan. But yeah, uh, if if I had an Intel Arc GPU, I would most certainly te uh, test the hell out of it and just publish details because that's the good. That's the it's the dumb thing to do. Publish all the data you can if for uh, like problematic things like Arc GPUs. What do I need to do? I need to make it now, don't I? Okay, so time. I almost did it again. I almost went for J6. I was thinking as well. Make install. Leave the directory. Remove the directory. Tile the next one. Did I install? I did. You, you, God damn it. You got me thinking about it again. You got me thinking about making it install again. J6 installing again. No. Oh well, it'll be fun. Right. I see the little love huts. Right. Done the configuration, so time make minus J30. We are not running the tests. We're not doing any of that. We're just going to do time make install. We will replace the bash, we'll leave the directory, remove the directory, tar the next one, enter the next one. Uh, make flags, but um, I don't think so. Considering this is a true root environment, so probably not. Unless I made like a a button. Hang on. God damn it! Macro macro keys on this keyboard don't work when they're not when it's not connected to in Windows. This has onboard memory. This keyboard has onboard memory, but unless it's not unless it's connected to IQ, it doesn't remember the fact it has onboard. <laughs> mm. Well, thanks. We do not approve of this. We do not approve of this. Mm -mm. You do not approve of this. Leave the directory, remove the directory. Lib. Lib. Our oh, hyphen XPF. GNU database manager. Be the GNU database manager. I think ah, Mr. Zach Friedman. Okay, good. You you said Teensy, and my first thought was um, Jack Friedman. Zach Friedman, even fuck. Why did I say Jack Friedman? Zach Friedman, him. Him with his Optagon. I would love, like, it was him that it was because of him that I actually spent some time um, looking at making keyboards. I'm making one for my dad who's left handed. Like, I, I, here's the thing I'm ambidextrous, which is annoying. It, oh, sometimes it's annoying, sometimes it, 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 it's fine. So, I wanted to make a keyboard where the. If, Instead of like a 60% keyboard, it's a 100% keyboard, but everything past the enter key is actually on the left-hand side. Specifically for left-handed people. Like, I thought of that, because he's left-handed. So why, why not? Why aren't there keyboards that just have that on the left-hand side for people who are left-handed? Why not? Like, it's because of that I genuinely spent some time thinking about. 
Is it possible? Uh, time. Make install. Remove EDBM. Honestly, Zach Rubin is pretty good. Ah, oh, hyphen XBF GPF. EDBF. Did I install? Please tell me I installed. I did. Okay, good. I couldn't remember for a second if I had, if I had actually installed it there. Time make minus J30. We're not running the test. Time make install. Leave the directory. Remove the directory. R hyphen XVF XPAT. Do the XPAT. End of the directory. Move on. Welcome back, my friend. Welcome back. Okay. Yeah, I, I really fucking hate proprietary crap like that. Yeah, I know. It's just making the matrix. <laughs> uh, well, I need new soldering iron. I need, well, I need new soldering iron. I need solder. It's just... I'll figure it out eventually. Eventually. Maybe. What should I say? Yeah, so I, I, I have now experienced what neurotypicals experience, and I'm not sure I like it. Because I've been put on um, medication by the doctor, um, my brain is now no longer running at 50,000 miles an hour. And there's silence. I'm not sure I like it. Leave the directory, remove the directory. Oh, that's time. Oh, I need this. And it's not it's it's not a stimulant either. Which is the weird thing. Like why why do I experience silence? I'm not sure I like it. Right, do that. This is just the in info stuff, so time make, uh, install and then the proper location. I just saw that appear there. That's wonderful. Yes, we will get through this. We will hopefully get some done today. I've got to turn the fan back on. Oh. You're a good fan. Thank you for doing the job that you do, fan. Yeah. Basically brain speed. Uh, brain speed. Um... Hang on. Uh, so it's ven it's venlafaxine. It is a antidepressant that belongs to the SNRI group. Um, it's basically so it's serotonin and uh, noradrenaline. Because <laughs> here's here's the fun thing: they don't know how this works. They do not know how this medication works. It just... I don't know how, but it does, which is the weird thing. I'm... Mm -hmm. It's fine. I'm sure it'll be fine. All right, make plan shit, eh? Make install. Into the correct place. Leave the directory. Remove the directory. R hyphen XVF. Less six four three C D less six four three. What are you buzzing me at? Oh god, that's another Facebook notification. I probably don't want to be looking at. That's not. Shout to me if you see me pick up my phone. Okay, good. So, time make minus J thirty. Did I do the configuration? I did. Time make install. Leave a directory, remove the directory, R hyphen XBF Pearl. Yeah, um, it's quiet. Things are quiet. And I don't know if I like that. Where are we? So we've just, we're on Pearl, so we're not quite. Are we halfway through the list? Okay, we're over halfway. Good. 
we need to get to E2F Sprogs, which is 87 or 79, we're at 42. Okay, so we're, we're over halfway. Good. Uh, we do have 35 minutes left to get this done, though. So, mm, this could be interesting. Yeah, I'm getting I'm getting phone call back from the doctor in three weeks' time. Because I I'm gonna have to mention to the doctor that I may have had some ocular pressure pressure last night, last night this morning sometime, because I woke up and my hands were changing size and like things were bigger and smaller, smaller and bigger than they should have actually been. Like just what? So I may have been having some ocular pressure, which uh, is something I will have to mention to the doctor when I speak to him next. On the configuration, no time, make one shot thirty. We're not running the tests. We're just going to do make install one and unset that. Yeah, I was told it takes about a week for them to kick in, a week for them to start being effective, and then. Uh, after three weeks, he's going to call me back see how they're doing. I might increase my dosage. Uh, I also have to go to the doctor's next week as well for my uh, asthma. Yay. Because my lungs just work. They don't. They really don't. Uh, so, time. Storm. That was correct, yep. Yeah. Okay, good. Yeah, my lungs just work. Not fun. Not fun. Oops, empty. I keep forgetting that. Is my water bottle empty? Yeah. Nearly. Right, so. Unset B build, bzip2. Leave the directory, remove the directory. Ah, XVF, XML parser. Need to move that. There, good. So, cd xml pass, xml parser, drop that in, pearl make file dot pl, I make minus, minus, minus j30. And now we've made it, we just need to install the time, make install, leave the directory, remove the directory, r hyphen xvf. Uh, INTL tool, CD INTL tool, that is the internationalization tool. By saying that one three times fast, internationalization tool. Okay, uh, I don't know what that is, so eh. Expl expl sorry, explain it to me. So time night one shit thirty. Okay. I hope Okay, that really did just install that fast. Did it really just install Okay, that really did, did just install that fast, okay. Install Fantasy Fast, I just want to make sure it's the time. Make minus J and make install. Leave the directory, remove the directory. R hyphen XVF auto conf. CD auto conf. Hmm. Weird. Yeah, we're not running the tests here today, Mike. That's a no go, Mike. I make my shade. JSA. I want to do time, make install, leave the directory, remove the directory. Oh, I think next VF auto make, see the auto make. We got 30, we've got 29 minutes left. We should be able to get through this. 
extra 30. We're not doing the checks. So I'm make install, leave the directory, remove the directory. Auto make our oh, hyphen XPF open SSL. Be the open SSL. Okay, if we're lucky, we should be able to get this done by. We should be able to get this done by the end of the three hours. We should hopefully, hopefully, be able to get it done. So time make minus three thirty. Okay. Oh God, sorry about that. But uh, hopefully, 28 minutes to get through. Last third, I'm gonna be pushing it. Really, I'm gonna be pushing it. But might be able to. Oh God, mail boys. It sounded liquidy. Mm, gotta, gotta love that. Right. Come on, let's get to it. Let's get down to business. I'm gonna time a play around. What is this? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, we have 32 packages left. I have 28 minutes to do 32 packages. Are you rogering me? Are you absolutely bloody taking me for a roger, Mike? Are you having a fucking roger with me, Mike? Are you having a bloody roger with me, Mike? Are you bloody rogering me, Mike? Fucking must be. Okay. Okay. Roger, roger. Roger, roger. There we go. Fucking hell, that took a Oh, it took a while because I didn't bloody give it make instructions. I'm going to shoot something. Maybe myself. Yes, we will. We will install the desired documentation. Leave the directory, remove the directory. Our oh, hyphen XVF K mod. Did he K mod? Okay, we now have 31 packages to do in 26 minutes. Oh, I somehow don't think we're going to be able to get that done. Minus 330. I've got to do more than one package a minute at this rate. Leave the directory, remove the directory. Five minutes for the F. Um, so elf utils, CD, elf utils. So time make minus J30. Come on. Come on. Okay. We will we will get there. Twenty-five minutes to get all of this done. Alright, uh tools, tar hyphen to lib FFI. Do the lib FFI. So I make hyphen J thirty. I make install. I can't have done it that fast, could it? Okay, the leave the directory, move the directory. Our next one. 
This one's gonna absolutely drag ass. It always does. This always does drag. The, the compilation instructions for this one really does just absolutely drag. Considering it has a 1.9 with a uh, 1.9, we should be fine. Compile, making, okay. Um, no, this is where things start to slow down. There's always this one. There's always Python with the tests that automatically... Oh, Python, no, I didn't want to run the bloody tests. Why are you doing the tests? Python loves to do the tests for no reason at all. I do not know why Python is doing it, but Python is doing it. I do not know why. I'm going to remove myself from reality. I'm going to just shift dimensions. I'm just going to shift over a dimension or two. It'll be fine. I don't know where I come up with this. I can't be the only one that thinks like that, right? <laughs> like, where do I come up with these random sentences that have never been said? Where do I just come up with these brand new sentences? Hmm. Yes, I'm just, I'm just going to shift dimension for a minute. It'll be fine. No, I'm going to try and find the dimension where Python doesn't run the tests in the install. And that would be um, parallel universe, not dimension. But yes. Because that's now just, that's now just delayed me massively. I have 28 more packages to go. And not 28 minutes to do it in. I have 21 minutes left. Just massively delayed me. I have to be doing more, more than one package a minute. And that's just delayed me massively. Leave the directory, remove the directory, file the next one. I've got no idea how, how long this one's going to take because I've not, I've not, this is new to version 12. Leave the directory, remove the directory. I'll have next if wheel. Okay, that was weird. Right, leave the directory, remove the directory. Okay, I'm starting to catch back up. Ta hyphen XVF ninja. CD ninja. Oh, freaks. Ninja drops equals 30. Oh, come on. No, don't. Ugh. And we're stuck. There goes the time. There goes the time challenge. Oh, never mind. Never mind. 
We're not running the tests. We're just doing arm hyphen R ninja tar hyphen XVF Mison C D Mison the directory, remove the directory R hyphen XBF core if core utils dot tar dot XZ, which means there's a patch for it, C D core utils. Come on, 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 come on. Don't, um, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We have now 19 minutes left. Sorry, 18 minutes left to get this done. 18 minutes left and more than 18 packages to go. Oh, come on. come on! Come on, 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 come on. Hurry up, hurry up. We're, gonna, we're not going to be able to get through the majority of this by the 17 minutes that is left. Come on. Hurry up. Right, okay, good. Right, okay, so I make one shit so that just took up so much of my bloody time. Install package. I make one install. Leave the directory, remove the directory. Ah, uh, hyphen XVF check. Check. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. I'm going to say J30. Leave the directory, remove the directory. I'll have an XP if you tell us. The diff. Diff you tell us. I will get there eventually. Okay, we have 16 minutes left. Okay, it's going to be pushing it right down to the wire here. I make time I can stop. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We can do this, we can do this, we can do this, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We can fucking do this. We can bloody do it. I make a 30. I make install, leave the directory, remove the directory. Oh, hyphen next we have gawk, maybe gawk. You need to find utils now, god damn it. Configure. I make my chair 30, hop right onto it. Install the package, bada bing, bada boom. If desired. And to leave the directory, remove the directory, tile and it's not it's XVF. Find utils, CD find utils. Okay, come on, we can do this. We can do this. There is 13 minutes left. We have more than 30. We have 19 packages left. It's gonna, it's gonna be right down to the wire. It is gonna be on the edge, like right down to the wire. Yes, I know. I know. Watch. Come on. Less than 13 minutes. Right. Okay. So. Did the configuration, so it's now time for making. So, I'm like, so we're going to be right down to the wire. These compilation instructions are going to murder me. Remove the directory, remove the directory. R hyphen R. 
Oh, hyper XP. I've got Roth. That's a new one. CD. Rock. Right. That's weird. That's, that's a, mm -hmm. Right, so page size. This graph is not a new one. It's this one, so it's A4. Come on. Come on, 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 come on. We have 13 minutes left. Make minus J30. Make, make install. And make install. Leave the directory, remove the directory. R hyphen XPS rub. Dot tile like said, cd grub, that means that's got a pack file. Unset environment variables. Done. Okay, that's done. By aggressive optimizations. We are going with aggressive optimizations. We have 12 minutes left. Okay, so done the configuration. So time, time, make minus 30. Leave the directory, remove the directory. R hyphen XBFD zip, GDD zip. Pushing it down to the wire here. 16 packages left and not 16 minutes. Come on. 12, uh, 11 minutes left. Move the directory, move the directory, tar hyphen XBF, IP root. Do the IP, IP route. Get all, please tell me I fucking installed. I did. Good. Why I didn't install there for a second. Fine. Mick. A30. Yes, we want this all documentation. Documentation. Leave the directory. Remove the directory. I have an XPF KBD. Dot tile dot XZ CD KBD. Right. Okay. That, sh that shit. Do. Do. Okay. We're at sixty-five. We have fourteen left. Did the configuration. So time make minus share thirty. Minus share thirty. So time make install. Time make install. Documentation. Yes. Leave the directory. Move the directory. Tar hyphen it to your lib pipeline. See the lib pipeline. Okay. Configure, install. It's going to be right down the line. It really is. I'm make J30. Fuck. I make install. So, we'll leave the directory. Remove the directory. Ah, oh, hyphen XP off make. Did you make? We're going to make, make using make. So grab this, chuck it in. Time make minus J30. Leave the directory, remove the directory. Oh, hyphen next we have tar. We're going to tar tar using tar. Also on safe configuration, yes. Almost there. Right down a I have nine minutes left to do six packages. 
No. Nine minutes left to do eight packages. Oh, this is going to be right down to the wire. Oh, it's going to be right down to the wire. Right down to the wire. Yes, yes. Okay, so time, make one, J30. Leave the directory. Oh, fuck. Hang on. Oh, I butchered it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Stop, stop, stop. Stop. CD tar. No, I didn't. That's fine. I went from the R. Uh, oh, well, I now have butchered it, haven't I? So. R hyphen XVF text info, CD text info. Grab chuck time make minus J30. Come on. Come on. Seven minutes. Seven minutes to do nine packages. We can get there. Good time at minus J30. I make install optionally. Yes. I'm make install. Chuck that in. Leave the directory remove. Remove, remove the directory. R hyphen X we have vim. Vd vim. S do I'm make minus three thirty. Oh, I didn't mean to hit enter. Probably shouldn't have hit enter. Probably should not have hit enter. Well, we'll find out in a second whether that's butchered it or not. Nope, it didn't. Oh, it's actually did it at the same time. Good. So, no, we're not running the tests. So, I'm make install. Configure it. We're not going to configure it. Oh, hang on. We have to do that. We don't have to do anything else. Okay, so leave the directory, remove the directory, tar hyphen XPF markup safe. Markup safe CD, markup safe. Pushing it right down the line. Okay, we're getting closer to not being able to do it in time. Leave the directory, remove the directory. Tar hyphen XPF. Uh, Ginger's going to kill me here. Ginger's going to be the one that slowed me down. Never mind. I have memories of Ginger being slow in the past. R hyphen XVF, System D. T-Y-S-T-E-M, System. Two, five, four. CD, System D. Two, five, four. Okay, we've got five minutes left to do five packages. Five minutes for five packages. Okay, we've brought it down. We've brought it down. This is good. This is good. This might, this might kick me in the nuts. This really might slow me down here. Ninja's going to slow me down. Although, Ninja Jobs, I gave it, I gave it the 30. I gave it the 30, which means it should fly through. Oh, yes. Okay, we might, might just make it in time. We might, only might, just make it in time. This is a race to the finish. It is going to be a photo finish. Good. So leave the directory and again remove the directory at 254 tar hyphen dbus cd dbus
This is going to be right down to the wire. I'm make minus J30. Come on. J30, good. Leave, leave the directory, remove the directory. R hyphen XVF. Man DB. CD man DB. Why did you want to move that? Drop that in. Okay, there's nothing there. There's nothing that I need to be worried about. So, time, make, minus J30. Okay, come on. Three minutes left. Three, three minutes left. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come, no. Oh my god, of course it'd be something like this. Of course it'd be compilation instructions that kill me in the end. Good. Leave the directory, remove the directory. R hyphen XV, hyphen XVF, pro CPS. CD, pro CPS. Okay, okay, we have three left. I'm make minus JT. Run. Do. Leave the directory, remove. Directory R hyphen XVF util Linux UD util Linux. Come here, come here. That's problem test. We're not running the tests. We're not running. Okay, so it's going to be. So I'm make minus J so run. Right down to the wire. Right down to the wire. Two minutes. Those warnings are fine. Leave the directory, remove the directory. R hyphen XVF E2F S progs. E2F S progs. D D E that's the last one. That's the last one, isn't it? Oh, it's not done until the fat lady sings. It's not over until the fat lady sings. It is not over until the fat lady sings. Time make minus J30. Over until the fat lady sings. Come on. Don't be the thing that screws me over now. Do not be the thing that screws me over now. Okay. And that is us done. I did it. No, I didn't. Fuck. Uh, CD, uh, CD, uh, E2 FS progs. It's not done. It's not done. It's not done. Okay, now we're done. We did it. Less than a, just over a minute left to go, and I did it. Oh! Not quite. That comes, uh, that comes after cleaning up. That comes in this section here. But that comes here. That comes here. But that is the entirety of chapter eight. From start to finish in less than three hours. From the start to the end of chapter eight in less than three hours. And I mean, only just only just got there holy shnikes <sighs> ow you know what we bloody did it we actually did it less than three hours that's what that's the goal i set out to do <laughs> Okay. It is. Only just did it. Only just did it. Right, I'd like to thank you very much for watching. Um, I'm not even going to be able to do this next week. 
yeah i'm gonna be able to do this next week weekend after no two weeks time i'm not gonna be able to do it but next week i can right we actually did it we actually bloody did it holy hell right if you'd like to assist me in any, in any way you can do with the, with the buy me a coffee link um you can buy me a coffee or contribute to a project your choice or become a member and again entirely up to you anyway if you're not already subscribed, maybe consider subscribing. Hit the like button if you liked the stream. Dislike button if you disliked it. They both work. Uh, ring the notification bell while you're down there, maybe. So you get alerted to streams whenever I'm live. And also when videos come out. And also when I make shorts, screaming at the fact that Ubuntu no longer wants to work. But this is Debian anyway. I'd like to thank you all very much for watching. I hope you have a good day. Good evening. Good night whatever it is wherever you are when you use linux don't panic goodbye